I'm going to say that this video is urgent because you guys have been commenting on the most anticipated sets you want LEGO deals on, and today I'm talking about it, the Sanctum Sanctorum, because I feel like it's almost at the possibility as a last chance, let alone at a discount. What's up, everybody? I'm your host, Krista, here from Stud City. We're going to be focusing on only two, maybe three LEGO sets that are worthwhile to buy on sale. So if that interests you, give this video a thumbs up. Let's see if we can hit 250 likes in today's video, and let's jump straight on into it. Yes, we're talking the Sanctum Sanctorum. The reason I'm talking about so heavily on this set is because not only is it retiring at the end of the year, it's extremely difficult to get. It its retail value is $250, and it's been on sold out on the LEGO website for well into probably around the two weeks at time of recording. So truthfully, middle October, it's going to be retiring at the end of 2024, meaning it's no longer going to be on shelves and already it's slim pickings and you cannot find this set just about anywhere so sold out on lego website another example would be amazon it's already 330 dollars on amazon which is a hundred and what almost a hundred dollars above retail price on walmart it's also 370 dollars which is over a hundred dollars in price and then in the aftermarket, we could go on eBay and check some listings. One sold on October 23rd for $340. Another one here just sold for $280 plus $40 shipping, so $320. A used one sold for basically face value with shipping and value would have been $250. Man, that is crazy. New copy, $313. And I'm assuming this set's only going to go up in price. Here's one, $250. That's pretty good. Um, anyways. It's retiring. I think this is probably the close to number one set that's retiring here at the end of the year. And there's a couple of reasons I think so. So it makes a really good investment Lego set. And don't worry, it is currently available on one website, which we'll talk about in two websites that we'll just talk about in a second. But I think this is going to be one of the best investment Lego sets of 2024 because it is the first Lego Marvel modular retiring. It kind of reminds me of Ninjago City back in the day when that one retired. It gone crazy in value because they continued to make more modular so like we got the daily bugle which was actually the predecessor to the sanctum sanctorum we got the avenger tower after and now we also have the x-band mansion so four in that theme and uh this would be the first one retiring making it probably it will definitely the shortest shelf life and uh, pretty interesting there so anyways that's kind of the price threshold i'm assuming it only goes up more in price as inventory levels continue to thin out However, I did find a few copies on Target. Huge thank you to Discord for calling this out. I personally just ordered one copy, and um, I'm really contemplating on ordering a couple more. I would love to invest more into this LEGO set. Um, I feel like now is a good time to do it. I actually paid $250 basically even because I have that Target red card, and of course, I used Rakuten to save an additional um, extra percent off, which is always nice. So they have 1% cash back on Rockets. And you can sign off also. If you're new, you'll get $30 for signing up with the link in the description. Regardless, um, use Rockets and guys. It's very helpful to help get extra savings like that 1% there. Um, $250 for this set though is not too bad. I know there's only a few available. So I bet by the time I post this, these all get cleaned out. Um, so best of luck shopping for that. I hope it lasts. I truly believe this set is not going back in inventory, at least from Lego. Maybe we'll see a flash sale at another retailer, like, you know, maybe Target or maybe Amazon. I doubt Amazon, but maybe Target again might restock or something like that. I'm not risking it. I know we've been waiting out for, you know, hopefully to get in this one score the $200, but I truly believe the best deal we have seen is double points with promos um we have not seen this set go on sale and you guys know i do definitely do my due diligence to try to buy find the best sales for you guys um and unfortunately with the time being against us on this set and we really looking for the last few months on it it just really did not go on sale as the popular demand of the set knows it's going to be a great one once it retires so truthfully i'm not going to tell you what to do but uh, i think it's worthwhile to not sit around and wait at worst, you could pick up a copy, and then if it does go on sale, you can always return this one and buy it back at a cheaper price. I got that comment um, here not too long ago, and I thought that was very well said. I forget who said it, but if you know who you are. Appreciate that comment. It was actually talking about the Hulkbuster. He goes, I picked one up for the $308, um, and if I find it cheaper, I'll just return it at $308 and uh, get it at the cheaper discount. So I think that's 100% worthwhile. I'm going to do the same thing with this one, um, to be honest. MSRP price, I think you can't go wrong for another copy like this. I have one built, 
And I would definitely want, you know, maybe at least one more, maybe two more to have sealed in the collection for um, investment side of things. So anyways, that's the first set we're taking a deep dive into. Not only that, is it available on LEGO website? I talked to Shop All Hub, which is that website that I've been talking to try and bring you guys the best deals. They have one listed for 560 and they only have four copies left, if I'm not mistaken. Again, that's a crazy price. Do not pay that. Um, that is just bananas. But I do have... They did give like a special discount, which is above MSRP. So if you're going to plan on buying this, I would definitely recommend buying from Target first. Um, but, you know, worst comes to worst. If those aren't moving, we still have this sale going on. It's $40 or no, $30 above above MSRP price. So at $280. And uh, the only way to get it is code Stud City Sanctum. Um, guys, there's no affiliate there's no kickback for this um this is just me talking to shop all hub trying to get a better deal for everybody so do keep that in mind i don't get anything out of this other than trying to find us a deal which is still above msrp price point i would hold this as a safety net just in case we can't get a copy um you can always get one from an official certified lego what store brand new sealed in box so keep that in mind if you want to go ahead and buy that sure go for it I appreciate it using the link. I mean, it just lets them know that they're shopping with the Stud City channel, which to be honest, I know a lot of us are. <laughs> so I do appreciate that. Um, but aside from that, if you guys do use these links, I, it just lets them know we are serious business and we'll probably do more work together in the future, hopefully finding us better Lego deals. So that's what I'm trying to land for us in the future. Anyways, so 280 on that one, definitely a better deal on uh, um, on Target. Uh, aside from that one though, I did find a deal again, and there's no kickback or anything like that. But I had talked to them about the retro radio. So this set here, 10334. This would be the second Lego set we talked about in today's video. That set's on sale for 15% off off the hundred dollar price tag. And we still have our code, our creator code of Stud City for 20% off. So it's actually 15% off and then 20% off of that price tag. So total for the retro radio. And let me know if you guys are stoked about this one or if you claim it. Um, I want to see you. I'm just curious to see how many people are going to buy from it. But $68 for the retro radio. I feel like that's a decent price point for a relatively newer Lego um, icon set, right? Not bad. Not bad. So in total, you'd be at, what is that, 32% off? Yep, that's a good one. So let me know if you go ahead with that. Um, the code Stud City works for on any Lego set. So they do have many other sets on sale. And again, we are not being sponsored by them in today's video or anything like that. I just... I'm calling out a good deal when I see one. So keep that in mind, ladies and gentlemen. But regardless, I want to do more Lego deals with them in the future. So, um, you know, if we use that code, I'm sure it will let them know like, hey, we're driving traffic here and uh, there's some good sales going on. So yeah, any of these sales items, the creator code will still work like this Vespa 20% deeper than that. I mean, same price, $68 for it. So uh, let me know. Uh, and if you want to see more deals from those guys, let me know in the comments below. And then the last Lego set we need to talk about is this one right here. I'm going to go ahead and pin this one in the comments. But uh, the Ambush on Mandalore Battle Pack is currently on sale from Amazon for $16. Now, this set came out earlier this year. I think it was an April release, if I'm not mistaken. Um, yes. Yes, yes, and double yes. This is the first time I've personally seen this Lego Star Wars Battle Pack on sale. And at $16, it comes out to $4 a fig. On top of that, it comes with really good Lego parts. Um, probably be one of my favorite battle packs for pieces. And uh, I'm really excited to see this one on sale because I do love the Mandalorians and the Imperial Commandos. I think it's a great battle pack. I went ahead and ordered 10 copies. Yes, 10 copies. Don't tell George Deanna. Hashtag swipe the card. But I think it's a good entry point and it's worthwhile to have a bunch of these. And I want to get more in the future. So hopefully we can find more sales like this. But for now, I think 10 was a good entry level at the $16 price tag. So so really stoked about those coming in as well. We have a lot of building of Lego to do. I'll just say that. But aside from that, those are three Lego sets that are on deep clearance today or deep talk of clearance. Let me know what you guys think in the comments below. Happy shopping and uh, best of luck scoring the Sanctum because our time is running out. Anyways, that's going to wrap it up. Love you guys. Hope you have an amazing rest of the day. I'm Christopher from Stud City. We'll see you in the next one. Peace out.